Hello everyone and welcome to another edition of ERB Reviews. Today we're taking a look at the Nest thermostat created by some of the original founders of the iPhone and iPod. Um, they were part of the original Apple team that actually helped develop that device. And when you look at the Nest thermostat, you definitely see a lot of similarities in the way um, it looks and operates and certainly the ingenuity behind it and um, just the overall development of the of the thermostat it's it's truly a remarkable thermostat and, and you know even today uh when i say that and i'm telling friends and family about it i think to myself my god what the hell am i talking about it's a thermostat right and not only that it's a 250 fifty dollar thermostat um but from the minute it lights up on your wall uh to the second you start using the ios uh, application and um, also there's an android app and some of the reporting that you start to see is generated from it to help you save money, become a little bit more aware of your utility consumption, you start to realize this is a pretty cool device and you start to wonder how you lived without it. Now, there's certainly other devices out there, uh, programmable thermostats that can operate via the internet. You can control them and adjust your temperatures. But, you know, just like with any other Apple product, there's other phones on the market, there's other portable devices and tablets out there, but somehow, they just put some kind of little magic sauce into these things that just says, wow, this is just a cut above um, the other devices. And, and, you know, and as a, a homeowner, I've had many programmable thermostats over my lifetime. So to have something like this has actually been a joy. And um, I look forward to reading my historical data and learning from my thermostat. And of course, just kind of wowing people with the look and feel and the overall operation of it. Um, it's just a really high quality thermostat and I think you're really gonna enjoy it. So today I think we have a good treat for you. We're gonna do a quick unboxing of the device and then a quick installation and kind of just show you what it looks like uh, powered up in some of the real basic features um, without getting too far into the weeds. So without further ado, let's get to the unpacking. So I've already done the, taking the liberty of taking it off the, uh, the plastic off here so you don't have to watch me do that because that's painful to watch. So the Nest thermostat, as most of you may or may not know, is a Wi-Fi capable internet programmable uh, monitor type of thermostat. Also has some pretty neat features. Also was supposedly founded by the original iPod and iPhone founders at Apple. And I suppose uh, the story goes they left the company and uh, they came up with this thermostat uh, kind of on their own. So taking it right out of the box here, first thing you see, very similar package that you would probably see in an iPhone or iPod setup, you know, very clean, uh, right when you open it up, boom, here it is right in front of you. Um, it's, it's right here, a little plastic cover there to protect the front of it. And right off the bat, you see it has a very shiny finish uh, with a black underlay with a glass finish on the top here. And um, looks like a speaker grill of some type, but I imagine that's where humidity and temperature sensors are and uh, some of the motion sensor technology. Has this rotating dial, which I'm sure we'll figure out how that all works. Seems to have a click function as well. Um, this seems to be a plastic housing, but it has a stainless steel look. This feels like real metal glass, but this feels a little bit like plastic. Uh, on the back here, you can see the proprietary connector. Also has a USB connection point here. I read somewhere that you could actually charge this device if for some reason your um, thermostat wiring is not actually charging the device like it should be. Um, then you can actually take the device off the wall, charge it, and then you can put it back on. So that is the main control unit, also included in the box. Uh, again, very similar packaging you would find in an iPad or an iPod. Uh, the owner's manual, everything kind of right there in that same cellophane. Lat Funny, you'd find the same, uh, this same type of material in any iPhone or iPod uh, box as well. So some uh, owner ma owner's manuals there. Um, next, we seem to have a base module here, um, along with an included screwdriver uh, and some proprietary screws. I understand they actually designed themselves so that customers didn't have to use their own plastic anchors. Um, because they're not very heavy devices, these thermostats, they don't really require a super heavy duty anchor. So they actually de developed their own screws with uh, what looks to be a bit of a meteor thread count um, to grab the sheetrock a little bit easier. Taking this out of here, has a level built into the base plate, has these push buttons here on the side so you can slide the wires in, and the proprietary connector on the back. So again, of course, before you buy this device, you probably want to go on their website and check the compatibility for your wiring. Basically, you'll take your old thermostat off the wall. You'll see what wires you have. You'll check off a couple boxes on their website, and it'll tell you, in theory, if your wiring is compatible 
um, with what you are going to be using. So pretty cool. I mean, I really so far like the fact that the packaging is great. Great little screwdriver, uh, the base plate and the screws included. Next we have in here what looks to be uh, optional mounting plates. This is going to be great because uh, as with anyone, if you take a thermostat off the wall, you know you're going to have uh, probably discolored paint back there or something that doesn't match your current wall. So these are included to cover any of your uh, existing paint. Give you a couple different styles here. A big one, a small one, and this looks like to be uh, a back plate for the other adapter. Also um, included a few more screws here and some instructions for mounting the optional mounting kit. So pretty simple packaging, looks pretty straightforward so far. Uh, we have our thermostat, check, base plate, mounting plates, a couple screwdrivers, we're ready to go. So we're gonna take you over to the next room and see if we can get this thing installed and working. Okay, so we have Nest installed and it's ready to go. Um, really didn't take much at all, it took about 15 minutes. I had the uh, old thermostat on, took the old thermostat off, put the new back plate on here and uh, put on the base plate. It was really nothing to it at all and didn't even think it was worth taking a video of. Um, literally 15 minutes um, making sure that all my wires were compatible, it went right in. So now it's already started to learn some of my habits here. Um, as you can see when the display lights up when you touch it, uh, when you back away eventually it'll go off. Um, right now it's cooling and as you can see if the camera will show it's 78 degrees up here in the corner and it's cooling down to 75 degrees. Now if you push the ring you start to see some more options. Now when it first came on I must add that it did take me through a very very easy to understand setup process which you can see online. Um, there's certainly other videos that will show you. Um, just ask you basic questions about the install in your house whether you have heating or cooling or uh, what other uh, if it's oil or gas and those types of things. Um, so I'm not going to go through all the menus here because there are some great videos already on there showing you all the different menus but uh, I did just want to show you um, the installation, what it looks like, very easy, very clean. Um, the, the patch here, uh, the plate covered very nicely over the old uh, patch there. And there's also different kinds of things here. You can see uh, schedule and energy reports that eventually we'll start to get. Um, these are your settings. That's where your Wi-Fi is, your account settings and things like that. If you just give it a little click, kind of see what's doing here. You got your fan your way mode, its learning schedule, your brightness, and all these great little informational tidbits that you can see here. And that's the Nest wireless thermostat. Now, I really don't know how you return, quite honestly, yet, because I have not used this yet. Also, I did notice a great feature, and this is great for parents. Uh, there was a lock feature on it, which seems to be also unlockable or lockable from the iOS app that you can download from the Apple Store. Um, so if you have teenagers who like to mess with the thermostat regularly, then that's a great tool as well to keep folks. And also, if you're a landlord who owns properties in remote locations and um, or vacation property, and you're not sure if the tenants turned on the property, also a, a great little gizmo to have, I guess, installed at the investment property. Uh, there you go, it went to sleep. And now the Nest is learning our habits. So um, very cool so far, very installation, love the look. Um, looks great on the wall and um, I have no complaints whatsoever so far. So with that said, thank you for listening to this particular review. We appreciate you tuning in and we'll try to provide some feedback once we have some historical data and some charts that we can show you. And if you have any questions, feel free to email us at erbreviews at gmail.com. And we want to thank you again for listening, and we'll talk to you real soon. Have a great evening.